We've received operation details. The Iron Heart Pulse has supposedly been detected in this area, but it's impossible to triangulate since it's dispersed in several directions. That's correct, Clay. I can feel it clearly, but it's hard for me to pinpoint its exact position. However, I can confirm it is in this zone. <sighs> we were deployed here to find one thing, and now we also have to find the Iron Heart. We'll have to look under every rock in Vespers. Freyna and I were sent here to look for a group of Volgus, who have stolen RK serum from Jaber and some other descendants. Freyna, Sharon, even I've already had my RK serum stolen by them once. Things will only get worse if we let them take any more of it. Those bastards. They satisfy their own desires by taking everything we humans have. They have to be stopped. If the Iron Heart is underground, then it makes sense that we're detecting the Pulse in multiple locations. Not only is 55% of the surface of Vespers composed of slick inside, but this zone has a high distribution of strange-looking rocks. It's also one of the few zones where there are Ancestors' ruins on the surface, and most of the Ancestors' ruins are built out of slick inside. That's why it's difficult to pinpoint the exact point of origin of the pulses. The characteristics of slick inside make it easier for pulses to pass through it, which means there's a higher probability of pulses being detected simultaneously from multiple directions. When I analyze the strata, there are spaces that feel empty to me. They are most likely where the ancestors' ruins can be found. All entrances to these spaces emit pulses of similar intensity. However, you will need to confirm in person whether these places are the correct paths to lead us to the Iron Heart. In that case, we'll need to check all the places detected by the guide. There's no way the Vulgus didn't prepare for this. All right, let's spread out and find the entrance that leads underground. That'll split the enemy's attention, so it's a good tactical approach as well. This is Enzo. I have set coordinates for the scan drone. However, Volga's forces have been spotted in the area. If the drone is damaged, it may make this operation more difficult. We need you to eliminate all enemies within the operation zone. These ones may not pose much of a challenge, but another force is inbound. Prepare yourself.
target spotted. Danger assessment, normal. Defeating this Vulgus will force the enemy to retreat.
Data acquisition at 100%. Connection to the drone has been severed. We analyzing the collected data. This is Glay. I found something. Meet me at the ruins outpost. This place has been mentioned in records throughout history. And as the name suggests, these are the ruins. Turns out this is where the greatest recorded number of ancestors gathered. Investigation by the excavation team and analysis by the Magisters uncovered records mentioning the breakout of civil war. The ruins are evidence, remnants of this war. We don't yet know why the civil war happened. Albion collapsed as a result of the war, and this is the only surviving record. Given the Ironheart is here, that may have been a factor behind the outbreak of any civil war. Past or present, the Ironheart definitely has the capability to turn the fate of in This is the first I've heard of this civil war. Ah, Freyna's theory is quite the Ironheart in, in Glay, I- I just wanted to be- Sounds like you'll have- I have so much to tell her, we'll probably- Enzo here. I've been able to expand my range to the vicinity of the ruins thanks to the data acquired by the drones and the guide. Transmitting surface analysis information and intel on potential entrances to a sieves. That's not far from my current position. I'll go. Glay, I'll go. That's where the bastards from the Order of Truth are settled. I'm the only one who can withstand the toxins they use. I'll leave it to you then. HQ will continue to monitor the situation. If anything happened to Freyna, please report immediately. Ooh, Just as you said, the Vulcus have realized there is a fire heart here. A Vulcus battleship has been spotted heading to our current location. A battleship? But how can we even doubt that there is an entrance here? Watch out! Movement on your right flank.
Another wave of enemy forces is inbound. Watch out. Descendant, they aim to prevent you from reaching the entrance. Exercise caution when engaging them in combat. I heard Volga's electrical equipment is obstructing the search operations. 
Volga's generators emit powerful static. That's probably what's getting in the way. There is a solution, of course. I'll tell you when I spot a unit which has a high voltage. Then you just need to blow the circuits and defuse it. Unit with a fuse identified. Take it out. to get rid of. entrance discovered at the ruins, currently inaccessible. Reyna, what's the situation on your side? It's not inaccessible, 
but I'm worried about how the Order's toxins might affect you. Looking at Freyna's route, I can detect large quick pulses occurring at the place marked as the entrance. That means there's a high chance this entrance is connected to the Ancestor's ruins. Let's regroup and go together. Shield! You're here. It's a good thing I took this side. Neither you nor Glay would have lasted. Let's go find this entrance. Ugh, I thought I crushed the Order. They've just regrouped. They're so horrible and dirty and disgusting. There seems to be no end to them. Freyna, calm down. Your heart rate is increasing. It could trigger a traumatic episode. We don't have any sedatives. So if you start having seizures, we'll have to send you back to Albion. All right, I get it. I'll calm down. Don't get your panties in a bunch. It's not enough for me to black out. on the antidote mechanism, stored in Albion. After comparing the data we have with Albion's existing data, we can either imitate it or create something similar. But since we need the data to be transferred safely, we need you to protect it.
Good job. The data transfer has been completed. All we need to do now is wait. out what it is. But let's send it to Kate first and get her to analyze it. Access successful. Beginning decryption. It is a substance administered by bullets of the Order of Truth. It appears to be a type of booster that activates toxins in the body. Accelerating decryption process. Descendant, you need to prevent the enemy advancing.
destroy the upper section of the device. That way we'll be able to find out what they're hiding inside it. Attempting access. I will disable their security protocols. to conduct any formal clinical trials. So we're the guinea pigs. This will be an excellent opportunity, Kate. You'll be able to collect data on the side effect. Hello, descendant. What can I do for you? Uh, Glay, I don't think we should joke about it. <laughs> you sound just like Jin. Adorable. Thank you for your hard work. Don't worry, I know how capable you are. I heard you worked on my RK neutralizer. I'm sure it'll be effective against the toxin again. You can trust me. To be honest, I tested it on myself at the clinical trial stage. I'm fine, so as descendants, you definitely will be. What did you just say, Kate? That neutralizer was made from the Order's toxin. Do you know how dangerous that was? Do, do I... Do I have to lose you too? Glay, I'm also part of Albion Headquarters. I'm one of many people working for Albion and all of humanity. The Descendants shouldn't be the only ones ready to sacrifice themselves. I'm ready to do my part. Let's help each other. Lighten up, Glay. Thanks to Kate's efforts, we can continue with the operation. Glay, this antibody will help you to stay strong for this operation. After all, it will give you immunity. I've tested it on myself. Let it go this one time. But never again, you hear me? Okay. Thank you, Kate. Analyzing layout of the ruins. RK covers 40% of the entire area. A point of note. The RK corresponds to a single pattern, unlike the patterns of descendants. According to the layout analysis results, the location of these readings is identical to that used for tombs and altars. the data we have gathered, there is a high probability that this is the tomb of one of the ancestors who died during the Civil War. The fact that they were laid to rest in such a deep location, either they were an ancestor of a high status, 
or they played an important role in the incidents related to the Iron Heart. I've identified the Volga's communications frequency being transmitted nearby. It will likely contain information we need. We should investigate. Ah, the Iron Heart isn't here. The Volgus came to excavate the remains of the Ancestor. They plan to use this to open the Ancestor's vault. I don't understand. The remains of an Ancestor are a vault? What do you mean? If the vault contains an Iron Heart, it may have been placed there intentionally to prevent someone from claiming it. The reason the Volgus have extracted DNA from the remains is likely because the vault can only be accessed through a bioscan. If that's the case, then the occupant of this tomb is the same individual who brought the vault. That's correct. They must be planning to use the DNA to allow them to bypass the biometric authentication and claim the Ironheart. Restore the disrupted communications. Noise removal complete. Checking contents. Sender, Enzo. He says the vault has been spotted moving to another zone. Have they found a way to open the vault already? Damn it! We need to get to that vault. Wait. We should secure the ancestors' remains and the data just in case. If the vault can only be accessed through the biometric authentication of specific DNA, then we'll need that DNA as well. I have disabled the Vulcan Station repository for now. I have also collected the data formatted sample of the remains. Well, that's a relief. We can't stand it when things go according to Vulcan's plans. Let's deal with these bastards quickly and get moving. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Bombs have been stabilized. All units return to Albion to prepare for the next operation. Got a question about the operation? We've confirmed the transmitted data. There's a vault where the ancestors kept the Ironheart. We can use this to our advantage. The Vulgus will need time to crack open the vault. Enzo, send the sample of the ancestors' remains received from the guide to Anais and tell her to hurry. We need to analyze the DNA and activate the biometric authentication before the Vulgus do. And to do that, we need to increase our combat forces in the field. I'll send any off-duty descendants, rendezvous with them at the outpost and proceed with the operation. Jeez, why am I being called in? I thought I'd be getting some R&R. &R. Making me work with crazies thinking they see a ghost. Nah, I've got other things to do. Jeremy, there's an iron heart in this zone. Have you forgotten that finding the Ironheart is the number one priority for all descendants? Also, since you've been assigned to a mission, you should conduct yourself properly. Continue to be uncooperative and I will report you to your superiors. An Ironheart? Oh, man, why didn't you say so from the start?
get to the point. I only picked up bits and pieces earlier. I didn't realize it was such an emergency. An iron heart right in front of us. <laughs> the place will be crawling with Corel's minions, but don't worry. I can take this opportunity to show you what an awesome descendant I am. I'm curious what Guide's reaction will be after I carry this entire operation. Let me know, will ya? <laughs> Alrighty, shall we get this show started? I'll use my incredible teleportation skills to scout all of the underground spaces. somewhere in this zone. These generators are the main power sources for the enemy's comms devices. We need to find the enemies who have fuses, take them out, and use the fuses to disable the generator.
repeater code from this point on. Hmm. Even though the code has been modified, the current output isn't strong enough to penetrate the enemy's classified communications grid. If we were to overload it, we would be able to increase its accuracy, but the Vulgus will be able to track our location. I know that will make it challenging for you, Descendant, but you'll need to tough it out. We don't have a choice. Guide, increase the output. Accuracy has increased by 40%. All communications content is being destroyed. Take this! 
this. Surveillance accuracy at 85%. I will try to maintain a level that will not cause the device to malfunction. surveillance info. Unfortunately, Alpha's just called us in to explain the overload. He is furious. Well, well, maybe just upset that the equipment is being pushed to its limits. I'll try to mollify. This is... First of all, this is only a theory for now. I must review the enemy's data before I can be certain. I have some ideas on why the enemy is collecting organic matter, and I have reached a hypothetical conclusion. The most probable reason is that their DNA analysis is still incomplete, and they're looking for materials to use as part of it. Hmm. In order to extract pure DNA from something, you need a refining process to remove all the other materials mixed in. And once refinement has been completed, you will still need to perform an amplification process. This process requires certain enzymes. So what you're saying, Guide, is that the Vulgus are extracting the enzymes they need from the giant tree. In a way, yes. As the giant tree has existed since the time of the ancestors, it will have accumulated a variety of organic matter. It may store materials which are difficult to find even now. The Vulgus may have predicted this. It is likely that they intend to extract all of the remaining organic matter left in the giant tree in order to find the enzymes required for amplification. If we can seize what they extract and send it to Albion, we can expedite our research process. I guess we have our answer then. Let's hurry. It's our turn to take something from them. Let's make them pay for messing with us. <laughs> 